run. What was the atmosphere like in here when you came in when they got that win? I think we were just fired up. Um, and, and, you know, of course, it's like getting the monkey off our back, but, uh, you know, we were just fired up. Um, we know uh, we, we can't just get too high. Um, we got to stay pre pretty even feel um, because, you know, we, we can't just get emotional, emotionally um, just too high, peak out, and then next game come and we were just content with this win. No, we we, we got to continue on with, with just building, you know, just building. When we get to the playoffs, it's, it's where we got to be our best. But right now, we got to just build towards it. On, on that note, I mean, you mentioned like the uh, defensive effort ramping up in the second half. And I know in the last few weeks, the defense has slipped a bit. Is it kind of like unrealistic to expect a max effort defensively, 48 minutes, 82 games? Like, is it natural that there are just going to be lulls sometimes? Yeah, yeah. I, I, every team goes through it. Um, where defense on possessions um, throughout the season. I mean, there's always going to be slippage. Um, it's, a, it's a long year. Um, for us, it happened to happen at the end of the, towards the end of the season. Um, but, you know, things change quick um, as games, as leads, as the score. You know, everything changes quick. So um, there's a, more than enough time for us to turn and, and use this momentum to, to push us and carry us through. Right now, as you're looking forward to the playoffs like this, do you go into work? Um, I think it just emphasizes uh, how much defense um, wins games for us. Uh, I, I think, you know, offensively we're going to make, we're going to miss shots. Uh, offense is going to come and go. Um, this is a fairly low scoring game tonight um, for what we score and, and, you know, what they score. Um, but it, it just comes down to, to defense. You know, we put our hat and rely on our defense, and, and we continue to work on our defense. It's going to take us a whole lot further than what we can do offensively. That defensive sequence for you? Uh, just locking down when we need to. Making plays, that's it. Just trying to make a basketball play on defensive end. Um, all year long, that's kind of what I pride myself on, just defending uh, every night. Getting the passing lanes, getting stops when needed, blocking shots, whatever it is, being in the right place. Um, and that's what I try to do. As a team, it seemed like you were there on their drives more in that second half, in in their space. What did you see as the difference in the second half? Uh, just getting more physical, using our size, our length, um, being the aggressors, um, kind of putting them on their heels. Important to the the big comeback and the charge in the second half. Uh, what was that feeling like out there to, to be a part of that big run? I mean, it felt amazing, you know. Um, we got back to our, you know, swag, kind of, you know, how we play. Uh, got some stops, you know. We got out in transition, sharing the ball. I think everyone, you know, um, from the first person to the last person did a great job. You know, even the people on the bench was fired up, you know, helped us come back. That swag, it all kind of starts defensively, it seems like. What was the key there? I mean, just being active, you know, um, going for steals, going for blocks. I mean, everybody did a great job just, you know, being locked in, helping each other. And I think um, that's what we played, you know, all season. And um, I mean, the last couple of games, you know, we got a little bit away from it. But um, today, you know, we can build on the second half for sure. I mean, we got to get stops. You know, when we get stops, we can go out and run. And I think when we run, Especially, you know, with PG, um, Russell, JG, Steven Adams, you know, we're more on post up. Um, me out there, you know, just try to be fast. Uh, filling corners, I think that's when we had our best. You know, and that's what we did tonight, that we just got to keep improving um, day by day, and uh, we'll be good. You said you guys get your swag back. How good does it feel to do that and get a win on the road against the quality opponent? I mean, it's a. Uh, First off, I mean, Toronto is a hell of a, you know, a team. And uh, to bounce back like that, I mean, it feels good, you know, for all of us, because we was on a losing streak, you know, and just to come out big like that uh, in Toronto means a lot for everyone, you know. Um, and uh, like I said, we just got to build on the second half and um, stay together.
Everybody coming into this game knew you guys had struggled the last couple. We just got beat by them two days ago. It felt like you guys came, at least even though when things were going early, with the intensity and the urgency you wanted. Did you feel that tonight? Yeah, most definitely. Uh, we knew it coming to the games would be a tough one. Uh, it's a playoff game, like you said. Played on two nights ago and coming here at that house. And uh, you know, just come out trying to compete, uh, have each other's back throughout the whole game. You know it's going to be highs and lows, so just, you know, just stay level-headed and stick together. And uh and came out with the W, so you uh, know, good enough. Tanis, did you feel like as the game wore on, you guys were in position more for their drives? It seemed like you guys were able to kind of get in there and stop their penetration in the second half. Uh, like I said, we had each other's back. Uh, we knew once if somebody got blown by, uh, it would be somebody there to help them out. And, uh, that was a whole mindset throughout the whole game, especially second half. You know, they're, they're, uh, it became a strong first half. So try to just uh, try to eliminate the the paint touches and just and just stick to our man. And we did pretty good, pretty pretty well in second half. What did this home and home series do for you? Like, like I said, it was, it was like a playoff series. You know, just playing one game at home, uh, have a break, and then playing at their house. Uh, but like I said, uh, you know, throughout everything, we stayed together. Uh, never put our heads down, no matter what situation we were in. Uh, you know, we knew we had each other's back coming into this. Uh, you know, every game we had each other's back, and just, just stay positive throughout the whole game. And, and with, uh, with a W, so uh, it's like it's a good note. Jamie, you drew a bunch of charges tonight, you personally and the team. Did you feel like there's any reason why you guys were in position to be there on their drives better tonight? Uh, yeah, I think everybody just did a great job of uh, being in the right spots, communicating. Um, we did a lot of scrambling. I think uh, everybody gave a lot of effort. Just to try to keep them out of the paint. Just try to keep everybody out of the paint. Um, well, tough at times, but uh, at the same time, I think we, we, we did it well enough to get it. Really, in the first half, you had zero fast break points. Second half, I think you had 16. Your finishing in the paint was much, much better as yeah. well. Was it just a matter of the finishing, or were there things you guys did better uh, to score down low and out in the break? Yeah, I thought we had good spacing, and I really thought that um, you know, we generate, we forced 21 turnovers. Um, that got us out on the break. We had a lot of number of situations, whether it was two on one, three on twos, and we finished well. Um, you know, we even generated some good shots from behind the three point line. So that was encouraging. We need, when we get out on the break and get stops and get out and transition off turnovers and misses, <laughs> we, gotta, we have to convert them to we have been you know, since uh, the All Star break because <clears throat> we just had a hard time scoring. And when you get numbers, you want to go up and down. Well, I think some of our defense was really magnified on the 17 turnovers, and I think for us, turnovers have really impacted our defense. Um, I think our half-court defense has been pretty good, and we've gotten back and have gotten set. The biggest thing is, is when you turn the ball over and teams are out you know, with numbers, whether it's four on three, three on two, two on one, it's really, really hard at this level to prevent teams from scoring. So you know, our defense really starts with our offense. You know, for us, from if we don't turn it over, how quickly can we get back and get the floor balance and get matched up, and then taking care of the basketball. But I think in the half court, for the most part, we've been pretty good. Um, but we've got obviously defensive rebound as well.